mother just hate their job? <laughs> you're, like, you just wake up and you're like, if I have one more day of this bullshit, I'm just jumping on a table and pissing on everybody. <laughs> no, you guys don't hate, I do. But with the weird thing, well, I, I work in a restaurant, so that would be a little bit inappropriate. <laughs> but when you're 30 years old and you wake up and you realize you have to go to a job where you have to sing a birthday song to complete strangers, <laughs> it's time to call your parents and go, I'm sorry, I should have listened to you. <laughs> You know that whole stay in college speech you gave me? You were right. I'm gonna follow my dreams. I don't need a diploma. I'm gonna be a famous comedian. 30 years old, I'm performing in a basement of a laundromat after I signed up today. Mason, I have to say this. My name is Louis Bishop, and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, I grew up in a faraway land, a far, far away land. 45 minutes north on 17, called Jacksonville, North Carolina. Now, in case you don't know about Jacksonville, Jacksonville is also home to not one, not two, but three military bases. Let's give it for armed forces. Now, a few years ago, Playboy did an article on Jacksonville because of the girl to guy ratio. There is 19 guys to every one girl in Jacksonville. Which for, was amazing for a guy that looks like me. Swimming in it. Swimming in it. Like they should like change the sign of Jacksonville when you drive and just say, Welcome to Jacksonville, North Carolina. Where fat girls can be picky. Because <laughs> they were picky. Very picky. You may know that song, Bottoms Up. <laughs> bottoms Up, Bottoms yeah, Up. Yeah, it's okay. It's guilty pleasure. Go ahead, you can admit it. I saw some brothers in the crowd. I know you know it. But the lyrics in it, there's this, the chorus goes, Bottoms Up, Bottoms Up, Throw Your Hands Up. And what? Tell security we're about to tear this club up. And I like it. I like it because you have a considerate thug on your hands. Um, excuse me, waitress? Um, yeah, can you tell security? Yeah, we're about to rip shit up. No, 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 no. Take a minute, let me get the staff together. I have quite a large posse with me tonight. Just uh, be careful with Jonte, he does get a bit stabby. And, and just don't, hey, don't rough him up. We, we just got those Pumas. You have no idea how long it took for us to find Pumas in that neon green. Do this. Are you tired of that 2.30 feeling? <laughs> Let's, let's take a five hour, let's pump this back up. Are you that too, the five hour energy is like one of my favorite commercials ever. My favorite part of that commercial is the guy who's, who's driving the, the tractor trailer and he's just walking next to him, he's like, yeah, I don't know, right around 2.30, it's like my brain just shuts off. Your brain just shuts off while you're driving 12 tons of gasoline down the highway? You kidding me? I would rather see, I would rather see like a commercial airline pilot like carrying, like just dragging along his little rolling bag and being like, yeah, I don't know, right around 2.30, it's like my brain just goes Because <laughs> he has autopilot, so. 